Hi guys, how are you? Today we are going to work on shoulder stability, shoulder strength, and grip strength. Uh, grip strength is very important in determining longevity. Grip strength, quadricep strength, and balance. Um, so one of the best exercises for grip strength is working with kettlebells upside down. Please start with light weight. You don't want to hurt yourself. Um, I would say this is more of a intermediate to an advanced exercise. Okay, so let's get to it. I'm gonna use a 10 pound kettlebell here. You want a pad for your knee bone. Okay, I'm gonna squeeze my glute. I'm gonna come up, bicep curl that. I'm gonna anchor my elbow into my rib cage for now. I'm gonna lift it up a little bit and I'm gonna come out to the side. Grip more with the pinky side of your hand. We rely on that thumb joint a little bit too much. I think that's three, huh? Here's four. And there's five. I'll do both sides to get a little. Okay, here we go. Squeeze the glute. I bicep that up. I'm gonna go out, in, out. Here's two, three, four. Use that pinky, and right there. Now we're gonna press overhead. Switch back, toes into the floor, squeeze the glute, strong center. Lift this up, we're gonna go overhead. One more here. Use that pinky side of your hand. Big, strong grip right there. We'll switch. Toes curled under. Squeeze that tushy. Nice, tall and upright. And one. Two. Three. Four. And there's five. Okay, I'll go a little heavier just show you. So this was a 10. 10. This one's a 15. All right, I'm going to get set. Squeeze my glute, strong center. Lift it up. You can always have your hand here just in case that weeble wobbles. Start light. All right, here's the 15. One more. Good. One, two, three, four. One more. And five. All right, I'm just showing you guys five repetitions. You can do 10, 15, whatever feels good for you. We'll toss that aside. All right, we're going to do a chest press with an upside down carry. I'm going to make the floor. So the floor is going to help um, just support me so I don't overextend anything in my shoulder. All right, make sure you can see me. Okay. Drive your low back into the floor, shoulder blades are on the floor, and then we're gonna come up. All the way back to the floor. Two, three, four, and there's five. I'll switch sides. Okay. Okay, let's start here. One, two, three. Four and five. Okay. I'll go ahead and do the fifteen. Same thing. I'm gonna start low. Drive my low back into the floor. Shoulder blades are on the floor. One, two, three, four. Set 
yourself. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay. All right. So you might want to spot her when you do these, uh, especially when you go heavier. So train smart, not hard. Um, just be careful, but it's really good for grip strength, shoulder stability, core strength, um, and it'll improve everything, as I always say. <laughs> Getting stronger in the gym translates to being stronger out there in real life. So have fun with these, give them a try, and let me know what you think.